Hey folks, I'm Grimwit, this is Eldritch. Ooh, I like that. I'm all adventury. So, let's get into the part of the game that I'm actually vaguely afraid of. Which isn't really true. I'm also afraid of the Mountains of Madness area, which almost made me have a heart attack. I'm not kidding. Like, that's not hyperbole. I, I honestly almost had a heart attack playing that part of the game. Oh yeah, story. So, the realm here of Cthulhu is green and creepy. Let's find out why together. First and foremost, I'm always going to go through this place stealthy-like. It's all wet and slimy around here. And the soul is guarded well around here. That is an explodey eye. Ah. Uh. It does two damage when you set it off, and oh yeah, it also explodes if you just get near it. There should be a way to set them off without... There. I hear the gibbering. I forgot what this thing was called. The only way you can actually find out the names of things, like according to the game, is by dying and then tweeting that you died. Oh good, wall spikes, awesome. Oh, I just, just came from here. I'm trying to remember what the gibbering thing was called. Just, it's not coming to me. This is a useless room. I hear the snoring of a star spawn. There it is! It's so adorably what the fuckery. Yeah. What what the fuck is what the fuck? Oh man. I got a lot of hit points. You just got in the way, man. I I didn't want to hurt you, but but I had to. Oh. We have some woken up people. Good. Get woke, woken star spawn is always a good thing. You, uh... How you doing there, buddy? You, you want to talk about it? You look like... Uh, let's just get out of here. This place is creepy. Ooh, ooh. Death from above! I'm not going to bother looting anybody. I don't really need the coins, so I am good. Oh, hey, one of these guys. Guns are, I think, twice as powerful as knives, which should tell you how many hit points that those guys have. Mm. A lot of open areas in this game, or at least in the uh, this part of the game. Whoa! Yeah, he saw me. Not that it did him any good. There's a rock. Rocks are like bottles of hop, only they don't break when you throw them. Interesting. Fruit. Usually there aren't any healing items this far into the game. Don't wake the baby. Star spawn. 
the sleepiness of them kind of makes them oh crap okay vulnerable I mean you can really kill them after three hits so it's not that big of a deal but uh, when they wake up they start throwing fireballs like nuts man oh hey there's a gibbering dude oh that star spawn sees me awesome cool Maybe he doesn't see me. I'm okay with that. I like having these bullets. Let's not go that way. It is a silly way to go. I have eight bullets. Do I want to try to drill through the hole again? Or I mean door again? No. No, I'm on the bottom floor. What the heck am I talking about? In fact, I've already seen the exit. Why am I not looking at my map? Uh, these guys here, these fishmen, I call them chests. Because let's say you kill them and they respawn. Who cares? They'll just go back to a wall and start banging their heads like they're listening to metal music. Alright. Well... Hi. Bye. <laughs> well, he knows I'm here. Had some toxic fruit. Uh, kind of want to get... Oh, hi. Crap. Whoa. Killed somebody accidentally. Who did I kill? Oh, that guy. <laughs> So by now you're probably saying, Grimwit, this isn't a hard looking game. What gives? Why is why is this a thing? Like how does this even count as a roguelike? Well, I think this might be called a roguelite. We had a key. The game does get more difficult way later on after you beat it the first time. That was pointless. Nothing. Now what are we dealing with here? I see some spikes. Hmm. I hear gibbering. Don't like the sound of that. Kinda wish I had more bullets. If I had more bullets, I'd drill through this wall right here. Guns. Fabulous. Okay, I can sneak by him without seeing, being seen. Or did, did he see me? Eh. Hello there, my good sir. Uh, I am not going to steal from this shop because I'm pretty sure it would cost way too much to trap this guy. He's bigger than normal. I don't know, can I? Whoops. Thought I heard something. No, he's tall. He'll be able to go over that, won't he? Nope, that won't work. I've never actually stolen from these guys before. I have the coins for it, so I'm not terribly worried about it. Now, what do you do? Conjurer's Talisman. Reduces artifact cost. Eh, not really. I don't think I can reduce mine to zero. But I will take these keys. And that meat. For once I actually do need it. Uh, guns, always useful. And, um, let's get out of here. He's actually being a sport about it.
Oops. Whoop. Hmm. Surrounded. Uh oh. Okay. Not the greatest. Not the greatest. Murder this guy. Good thing it takes him a while to wake up. Murder this guy. And, hmm. Let's get from the open area. I see a chest. Ooh, that's pretty. Nice and green. You know what? Say what you want about the creepiness of Cthulhu's realm. Um, it's, uh, it's pretty. Guy had some coinage. Uh, side spikes work the same way as regular spikes. Don't run and you'll be fine. Ooh. Toxic fruit. Or, I mean, just regular fruit. Never mind. Let's try this away. Ah! I believe that's my wife. It's kind of tradition for her to text me while I'm playing video games for the internet. Is there any there? No? 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 Okay. Hmm. She certainly does want my attention. She can wait. Oh, shit. Now that guy certainly knows I'm here. Oh, no, he doesn't. Cool. That worked out well. Just go over here. Come on. Get closer. Okay, he's dead. <laughs> Notice I'm not doing a whole lot of looting because most of these guys are too dangerous. Here, another snore, snore, snore. They're so cute when they're asleep and not killing me. Oh, I've already killed you. Have I been here? Impossible. Hi! Well, now you have to die. Ah, oh, there's the exit. Let's be careful about it, though. All right. Pardon me just a moment. Good for her. You can climb back upstairs if you need to. And the randomness of the level is set until you die. I don't think that causes a... Don't know if that gives people attention. Let's find out. I don't see anybody coming to see me. Hello? The, the people who want to talk to me? Hello? Ah. There is a guy who wants to talk to me. Somebody just set off a trap. I always find that hilarious when it happens. What is your pattern? Okay, you're coming back. Which way are you coming? 
Oh, if you go that way, then you're gonna set off that guy right there. Um, no. Right over here, dude. Hmm. Figured that would have got his attention quicker. Let's grab that. Is he sleeping? He's sleeping. He's sleeping the long sleep. He's probably dreaming, though dead. Mental note. Turn off <laughs> Steam updates. I apologize if you find that distracting. Oh, somebody set off another trap. There are traps everywhere. Okay. Need to head down. This is the third level, so I need to head a special kind of down. Oh, crap. Don't see me, don't see me, don't see me. Fuck. Hi! <laughs> oh, that's, that's the... That's the best kind of laugh. The nervous laugh. Okay. See that glowiness right there? I believe that means my goal is underneath it. I can't remember. Why is everybody awake? There should be more sleeping people. Go to sleep. You need your sleep, man. Okay, that guy's sleepy. That guy's not. Oh, shit! Die, die, die! I'm catching them on good days. When... They're hesitating to fight me. And yes, that's a good day. Huh? Nope, you didn't see nothing. Nobody's here. Down here should be the Sola Cthulhu and prizes. Is that a leaf or is that. Oh no, that's a dead guy. I'm cool with that. Oh shit. Trap. There's where I need to go. And honestly, I can do this legit, I think. Yes, I can do this legit. This area here, usually I end up drilling through the top and coming in that way. But occasionally, I'll do this legit. Spend a couple of keys, and then just walk in, kill this guy. Everything's cool. Oh, and I got an achievement. Weird. This must have happened before there were achievements. All right. When next we come back, I'll probably die. You won't want to miss it. <laughs>